Hi Nipati dear viewers. Today's topic we're going to see is how to set the focus error on the text box. For example, you are just using one record field validator to throw if the text box is empty or null. That time you will not get the idea where that error which text box it's pointing out. So we are using one set focus error control to control this focus error. Let me see in real time how it's working. This is my previous things I did for the tutorials. If you want to see what are the things going on in ASP.NET, you just go through our previous video. Yeah, I am just adding one table. The table format is used for all the login registrations. If you want to create how to create the table, you just go through our previous videos. These are the things I explained in previous things. You can easily understand if you see these videos also. Here I am planning to add one text box. Uh, yeah. I am adding, I am planning to add two text box and one button control to validate the text box. Let me see how it works. I'm just drag and dropping the text box over here. You you can also write through code that I will show you in previous tutorial. There is option in that toolbox standard. You can drag and drop all this control text box button everything. You can drag and drop. It's a predefined tag in Visual Studio. You can use this. And then I am just drawing the record field validator to check it out whether this field is empty or null so I, in that validation tag there is an option called record field validator you just drag and drop there I am just copying this id and paste it to control validate which I am setting where to it means which text box I need to be validate I am just copying this ID of two text box and giving this one by one in identical way. I am just changing the error message, something called related with the text box and the column. Then I am using four color for this to show what are the error message in red color. So I am just adding the red four color and just copy and paste it for to validator. You can see in design also how it works. It looks pretty good. Okay, it's a simple format I created. We can add the styles if you want. I'm just running the application. Store some error. Oops, actually, uh, I'm not deleted in C shop file. Some files I added for previous tutorial. I'm just deleting this one. And then saving and run it again. It's, it works perfectly. Oh, before that, I'm changing the text box. Sorry, button has textures, button textures, summit. It's related to this because it's taking default as a button. Application is running. Let me see what is the thing is going on here. I'm just clicking the 
submit it throws the error because there is no field in this text box now it won't throw error because there is uh, some fields are in this text box i am just now uh, we need to identify what the things is going on here i am just copy this record field validator one to here let me see this things let me see uh, run and explain you what the things why we need to use the set focuses on error now i am submitting i'm just to realign this submit please enter the name i don't know where it is showing this because uh, it's aligned in nearby we can understand and we can find out where what is the things is if you add it somewhere it's be difficult so for this uh, error rectifying method we are using set focus on error to true it will throws it will focus where the error going to be displayed i am just reloading this one and just to sum it now it's focusing right yeah it's focusing the text box one because i am given the control validate to text box so it's focusing there now you can understand what is the essential use of the set focus on error right yes absolutely yes it's focusing yeah you can see the difference in normal text box on this things okay likewise we can use this uh, set focus error for find out where the control is there so this things is easy to understand but these are the essential thing we need to learn in asp.net thanks for watching guys more videos please subscribe our channel please encourage us by giving some commands thanks thanks buddies